Excuse me, Mr. Gilmore? Luke? Yeah, hi. Oh, don't remember you being this tall. Yeah, sorry. Oh, it's nothing to apologize about. Where are your clubs? Oh, I just uh, figured I'd rent some. Oh, waste of money. Owning's the thing. Right. There is no better place than our pro shop. Great. Let's go get you some clubs. Excellent. You're on your game today, Mr. Gilmore. Indeed I am. Indeed. Indeed. I'm going to speak to the board about these grounds. There are dry spots the length and breadth of this fairway. Hmm. Oh, I'm up. Okay, let's see. Uh, I think this one is not the one I want at all, but this one here. Oh, good choice. Let's take the tag off there. Good idea. Okay, ball goes down here. Oh. Damn! No problem? Yeah, it's heading toward the wrong hole. Just a mulligan, son. Try it again. Well, golf isn't my thing, you know. It's definitely a thing, but not my main thing. Well, what is your main hobby? Uh, give me a hobby quick. Uh, reading. Reading? I read like crazy. Wonderful. What have you been reading lately? Uh, books, you know. This, that, uh, dick. Pardon me? Uh, a dick guy, science fiction guy, dick something, something. Dick, I just read one of his. Well, I'll bring Dick up on the internet, see what comes up. Wish I could remember that name. Uh, you better hit your ball, son. Uh, we're stacking up. Right, yeah. Okay. <laughs> just a second, guys. He's, uh, he's new. Oh, jeez. Not to worry, the cart's been dinged a thousand times. The guy driving it looked mad. Not to worry, let's go. So, have you put much thought into franchising? Franchising? That diner of yours. Now's the time to jump. There are opportunities abounding in real estate right now. Uh, well, no, I haven't. I'd concentrate on the eastern seaboard first. Connecticut, New York, Massachusetts. I'd start with uh, five to seven. Diner? Something manageable. You'll need an investment banker. Ah. Just ran into Herb Smith in the clubhouse. Best banker in the business. I'll give him your number. Good. So, once the first seven are a go, shoot for the moon. National expansion. Set up a public corporation, issue an IPO. I got to an IPO. I got to set up one of those. Have you ever gotten a straight razor shave? No. Shaves you close, lasts for days. I'll give you my barber's card. Hi, thank Thanks. You. Good afternoon, Dragonfly Inn. I franchised my place. What? The diner. There's going to be seven of them, and that's just on the eastern seaboard. Then I'm going national. What are you talking about? Your father wants to open up a chain of Luke's diners, and I think I agreed to it. No. I've already got a marketing guy. Herb's my banker. Your father's taking care of all my insurance needs, and apparently everyone is going to be able to buy stock. Ugh, my parents, my stupid parents. And he wants to shave me. Shave what? I don't know, he just kept talking about shaving me and I'm tipsy. We hit the club bar and I didn't want to sound dumb and just order a beer because it's nitwit juice. So I had what your dad was having, which was whiskey something, more whiskey than something, let me tell you, because I can't even see straight. Oh, you poor thing. And I've got an art dealer now. No. I'm driving to Manhattan next week to look at some demon corns. What's a demon corn? I don't know. Oh, and I bought some golf clubs. They cost the same as a car. Where are you now? I'm at the driving range. Your dad's making me practice for next time. No, leave. You do not need to practice. Oh, and I sort of implied that I'm fond of the Greeks, so I have to read the Iliad and the Odyssey so we can chat about it. And can we not hang out with your parents for a very long time? For a very long time. I mean, I don't hate them. Leave the driving range at once. I don't think I can drive. Honey, have some coffee and then come home. The demon corn guy's still in there. You stay away from the demon corn guy. He's chatting with my rare coin guy. Just do not go back in the clubhouse. Go straight to your car. Okay. I like the valet guys. Good. Now go. I'm going. <laughs> 